<laughs> yeah, that's not a fun job, I will fully admit. It, it is not. And I made the hin the rotors a little too far away, so it was even worse. But they attached the first time. <laughs> Um, yeah, I'm going to say this is plenty. Oh, boy. There's so many batteries here. Uh, so... These. Did it... Okay. Pod racer. <laughs> this thing doesn't have an antenna either, now that I'm thinking about it. You guys are probably going to need to see an antenna. Well, you can throw a small antenna lots of places mm -hmm. that sounds like a threat <laughs> you know you could take that small antenna and put it lots of places it, it wasn't a threat and I wouldn't have said lots of places if I was saying what you were insinuating that I was saying <laughs> there may have been a specific place <laughs> yeah I may have been more specific. Let's put Are it that sure? just more specific. I think I'd use the default antenna. That way it'd stay yeah. slim. But yeah, you got the room. You got that turret on top. So yeah, it's not a problem. I considered it, but I kind of like the way it looks to be sticking off at an angle like that. It's just kind of quirky. And this is like a quirky little ship. Honestly, it's not very well designed. <laughs> I gotta just slap it together really quickly. Uh, let's see. So, oh, oh. Don't do it. Oh, no, 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 no. It's crashing again. It looks like he's back in. I'm going to not join the game just yet. Just in case he crashes again. But I am hosting a screen. Stream. Screen. Huh. His. Yeah. My. The screen on my stream? Yeah, I, I am hosting your scream as you keep crashing. Because you're screaming. Yeah, I'm, I will be. I will be soon. Scream 3, the screaming. <laughs> I'm just basically saving like every step of the way now. <laughs> It could be, sometimes projections cause some funky issues, but what I seem to be running into is um, my graphics driver is crashing. Um, and when I look in the logs, I'm seeing I'm having issues with that. So what I've been trying to do is reduce the graphic settings and kind of turn shadows down, turn off uh, post-processing, and, and kind of you know reduce all the, the load on the GPU. As best I can tell, it's just something in, something in the rendering is crashing. We are using a, um, a rendering mod on top of the stock game to give us better lighting effects, better textures, etc. It's very likely that mod is giving us problems um, in addition to maybe everything else we're doing. Who knows? <laughs> Space engineers. <laughs> it crashes a lot. Um, what I should do is I should actually get the hangar doors set up because that was one thing I meant to do. Uh, so, port side. So we have switch and okay I'm gonna try to join now states Starboard, set of factions hmm. door open close on off go saving okay so now We have the ability to open this door. That light turns on. Although, I can't really see that light from out here, but I suppose that's fine. I mean, whatever. Okay. Saving again. I'm gonna try to fly this little silly thing out of here. Okay, I'm out. Cool. Wait. 
Why are you going down? Not all my thrusters seem to be on. That's better. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> this is just like a stocky little fighter, but I like it. Um, let's see if I can just slap the rest of this together. Maybe I can just put some plates there or something. <laughs> okay, yeah, so it sh I should be joinable, so hopefully everyone can jump in. I mean, this is probably an argument for getting a server, because it would be more stable than running it locally with, you know. All right. Um... Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, I like the way that sounds. And I also need to get control for the turret up here, so I can turn that on and off. Can you not point at my truck, please? Or Moshi? I might. Just in case you accidentally shoot. I'm gonna shoot at the darkness. Uh, yeah. So, I think so far things are looking pretty good on this thing. Um, there's just a few more tweaks I want to make to it, but for now, I'm feeling pretty happy about it. Um, I should go ahead and name everything. Uh, uh, what is it? What do we call it? Pod Racer? Yeah, Pod Racer. Uh, which I guess is going to be PR, so I'm just. Dude. Something. Did you crash again? No, the heads are not on, dude. Oh, no. I, and I don't have tools. That's annoying. I have to find a place to get tools. I had the heads on there, man. I had them on now. Yeah, that's one of the most frustrating things to have to redo. I should be able to get it from this connector, I'd hope. Right, empty. I see. We need a welder. We need a grinder. We need one of those. We need. Okay. Oh, did not have my number lock on. I'm going to need some more things. I don't know why I have such a big cargo container on here. That's so ridiculous. I guess I can haul stuff if we need. Um, there's nothing we can really do here with these. Well, you probably need to get ammo for... I don't know how much you got of the types you're using, but... Of uh, 650. Okay. Okay, so now... Um, oh, we don't have my antenna on this thing. Uh, let's do this. This is neat down the way. Oh, man. Oh, man. That. an exhaust pipe on the back. I certainly have plenty of opportunities to rethink this design. Any part of it I wasn't happy with. <laughs> I think 
we'll just stick with what we had because frankly what if you set this to electric arc then you can see that particle from like really really far away so what we're gonna do is find that exhaust pipe okay. prefix it uh, electric arc Uh, let's see, 20%? Sure. Around a save. Not moving. Wait, are you showing my stream while you're working? Yep. Oh, interesting. I'm just uh, redoing right. something they've already seen, so. Because somebody <laughs> said something about the weather. Food check. Food check. Not quite weather, but. And I gotta recolor some stuff. Don't know why. Come on. Let me get in there. There we go. And. Boom. Okay. So, let's see, do you want to go to the planet, or do you want to help me build these things, because you're better at it? Um, well, um, I would like to head to the planet. Okay. See if we can find ourselves a base with which to accept contracts. So, I'm slapping some um, solar power on here, just so... If there's anything you want in the cargo, please do so. Uh, you might want to make sure we have plenty of uranium. I will do pre-flight checks with the truck. I don't think I can do anything. Oh, maybe I can. Uh, let's see here. I will. Hey, put... pop up sir is joined. Run a save quick. Sorry about frequent saves. Just want to make sure if we crash, we're not going to lose as much progress because that's so annoying. Oh god. There we go. Yeah. So we'll try to run frequent saves. Okay. So I'm bringing plenty of uranium. I feel like this thing needs to be other, something other than black because with it being a fighter, I feel like it needs to be a little more visible. Maybe we'll just stick with his theme of gold things are dangerous. Kind of like that. Maybe we do a little mm -hmm. combination of gold and black. Yeah. Yeah, let me go back to black and let me make certain accent bits go. I need you to do something because I don't want to mess it up. Okay, what's that? I want you to unconnect the truck so I don't drop the um, welder by doing the wrong one. 
I think it's the back right. I think that's what it's called, but I'm not sure. And I don't want to mess it up. Okay. Um, are you in the truck? I am in the truck. Uh, the, I'm ready for everything. Yeah. Okay. I'll just unlock you. There you go. You're free. I think that gold cockpit is too much. We'll make that black. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh. Really quick. Oh, I just started. I just got one of those hitches that felt like it was going <laughs> to. It was gonna crash. Hello, says Pop Up Sir. Good to see you again. I think. I what I would like to. to do is this vehicle that's in that Pop Up Sir's got that they're building in the hangar. Um, once this is built, I think we can potentially um, latch this to the rear of the truck and bring it down. I just realized the cryos are upside down on that. That's fun. Oh, uh, we're gonna. Oh, yeah, because if we're gonna take that with, is there a place to uh, connect it with the? Um... Yeah, on the back. Because I do have a mag plate, but it's really close to the light, so. Man, this ship is gorgeous. Thank you. I like the truck, too. I know you weren't talking about mine. I know. So, well, I like the truck too. I mean, that's not going to be able to drive out, right? Yeah, I think I can tug it with my um, fighter craft with the pod racer. Okay, because we're going to have to get it out, or at least to a hangar door, maybe. That might work. They're on the front, right? What do you mean? The hangar doors. They're on the. The hangar doors are on the back of the Moshi. Okay, so... I wonder if we put uh, blocks so he could drive out. Well, but he doesn't have any way to pilot this thing. I mean, we could... <laughs> we could drive the Moshi into the atmosphere or, or into the gravity. Well, it and, has gravity, uh, doesn't it? We have a gravity generator. But this doesn't have artificial mass blocks on it. Oh. But okay. we could drop the Moshi into partial gravity, and that should be enough to drop it, but we don't know if this can survive the fall. Like, does it have parachutes? Well, I can pick it up with the truck. I just need to get it out of there because the truck can't actually go into the hangars. Yeah, and I can get... Oh, no. I got stuck. <laughs> there we go. So, um, if you can I, get it I, out, then we'll Yeah, I should out. be able to tug him out, I think, with the um, combat craft. Because I got that plate on the bottom, yeah. so... Good, it, it has parachutes. Oh, I see him now, yeah. So, this thing can parachute. So, really, we could just get him into microgravity and then just have him drop off um, with the combat ship pulling him out of the hangar and then just releasing and then we can just kind of follow it down <laughs> oh this thing is so nice oh ugh ugh not doing well. Running a save. Sorry for the save lag. We are just going to save often because, you know. You know. Mm -hmm. 
So, yeah, I'm just sitting in a cryo now. It's not particularly interesting. Oh, yeah. no! There it went again. I need, like, a cr uh, crash to desktop counter separate. <sighs> yep. Are you, are, you, are you actually crashing? <clears throat> yeah, game's crashed. Because I don't have the connection yet. Yeah, but I can't do anything. So, yeah, you're crashed. And this little guy again. I guess I, what I could do here now... While we're waiting for this whole thing. Oh, there's the truck. Is oh, I put it on this side. That's funny. Life is what happens when you're busy making other plans, Lennon. Oh, that's a good one. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and charge up here. So I am now connected to the truck. Mm -hmm. Oh, I just said save. I didn't actually save. That's funny. There we go. Okay, it looks like you've just jumped in. I'm trying to. I tried last time and it crashed, so. <laughs> uh. There we go. Got that one added. Alright, so, yeah, I've just been kind of leaving that one alone for now, so I suppose, uh, let's see, at this point, I can set up my event controller. And we're going to say, if it is connected... Uh, we're gonna go, let's see, connected true means recharge, connected false means auto. Okay. Turn these guys off, and back on again. Turn these guys off, back on again. Same with thrusters. Uh, same with the exhaust pipe. Um, make sure we turn off the turret when it's connected. Yeah, we'll just auto turn that off. Uh, sure. There we go. And now it should be set up that when we disconnect, everything turns on. Oh, I should have done the antenna too. Uh, oh, I don't. I hadn't put an antenna on this yet. Uh, we'll just do a small one for now. Screw it. Oh, I just did it again. I just said save. Jeez. Looks like this thing is coming along pretty well. I suppose we could always add a projector directly to it. <laughs> Looks like a turret for people to hop in and control. <laughs> yeah, basically. Yeah, it's just meant to be like a little... It's just like a little gun. Just like, that's all it is. It's just like a little mm -hmm. gun. Speed around and shoot stuff. That's all it does. Okay. Mm -hmm. And the rover is about 75%, he says. So that's looking good. 
think for the pod racer, like, like I said, yeah, we could potentially. Oh, it does have a, its own projector. Oh, that, we suppose we could. I mean, it does have suspension on this side. I will just let it build because it's it's almost there. We're not gonna tempt fate again. Let's see. You are in the driver's seat of the truck. Great. And then we've got our driller over here. Which let's check. Does this have ammo? It does. Nice. Here, nice. This is refilled as well. Run another save. Sorry for the abundant saves. Okay, so at this point. I'll tell you a surrealist joke. You know, uh, are you into surrealist art at all, Veggie? Uh, not one of my uh, passions, no. But uh, you can sort I, I like jokes. Well, I really like surrealist art and uh, stuff like Salvador Dali that's got, you know, really unusual and unpredictable stuff, right? Mm hmm. Um, so the surrealist joke I know is um, how many surrealists does it take to change a light bulb? Um, I've heard this, so I can't remember the answer. I don't know. Yeah, the answer is the fish. The fish. Yeah. Did you change the Did you change the emoji to dead? Because <laughs> <of> the stream. Because <laughs> <laughs> that's so appropriate. <laughs> Uh, oh no, Miguel's game crashed again. I'm so sorry, buddy. Yeah, yeah. At least we're not the only ones it's happening to. I guess mm -hmm. you can you can join us in our misery. <laughs> I it's haven't so crashed yet, so at least this time. I mean, there was one time I I tried to join and then it, I had to restart the app, but. Well, it looks like, let's take a look at your turrets. Your ball turrets? Yeah, okay, they're looking good. Mm -hmm. Man, I see what you did. You put a full full array up here. You got missiles, you got assault cannons, you've got Gatlin guns. Mm -hmm. And those and are going to got... be the railgun snipers. Ooh, railgun sniper turrets. Mm -hmm. So we're going to have a couple uh, custom turret controls. Uh, so you can jump in there. Uh, they'll have probably, what, four railguns per yeah, at least two, at, yeah. at least. But I like to do four. Yeah, so if something comes within a certain range... Just snipe. They're <laughs> not going to be moving much. They so. get auto-sniped. Yeah, the the best... And I think that's honestly the best turret, in my opinion. Is, um... <laughs> if your camera's going to be on me, my camera's going to be on you. How about that? Okay. Well, um... I'm just sitting here because I'm kind of scared to move. <laughs> Tell you the truth. <laughs> Don't touch anything. Plane yeah. is watching. I'm just sitting here waiting for that thing to build, and then we'll see <laughs> if we can get it out of there. And then I can kind of pick it up with that little uh, mag plate on the bottom. Yeah, I think we could. And then get him at least in the atmosphere, just... if not all the way down. Well, if we just bring it out into space, right, and mm -hmm. then just let go of it, so it's just just floating there, you might be able to back your tank or tank your truck into it and attach that rear connector to it. Yeah, that's possible too. I don't know if it's you know wide but enough, but I, I do heard have... you say. I'm sorry, I heard you say mag plate. Do you have a mag plate on the underside? Well, yeah, uh, below the light. Oh, that's right. So you could just grab it with that. Yep. But I don't know if it would damage his ship if I grab it. I don't know if there's a place to grab. But it doesn't matter because, you know, I do have that connector. So if he can just float into space for a little bit, I can probably get the connector lined up. Sure. Or somebody can. Anyway. Somebody said something about, the water. about a connector. <laughs> yeah, somebody said something that they could connect to the connector. 